High water has led to hard times for people all over town. Some found themselves or their cars suddenly stranded this morning in more water than they could handle. And as Katrina Weber tells us, the calls for rescuing some of them also kept first responders extra busy this morning. Even before the sun came up, it already had been a day for San Antonio firefighters and police, as well as the people they had to rescue. Beneath the Austin Highway Bridge near Corrin Road, they say a woman nearly got in over her head around 2 this morning when she got out of a car stalled in high water. Firefighters pulled her from chilly water up to her neck, then sent her to a hospital to warm up. They also helped her three friends to safety. All were expected to be okay. A few hours earlier, they searched for five people reportedly swept away in a tunnel near I-10 in La Monte. Crews found no sign of them, but the problems with way too much water persisted throughout the morning. In the first eight hours, firefighters answered 25 calls. Some of these high water problems happened in especially unexpected places like this downtown street, Santa Rosa. One witness told me at one point there was two feet of water over the street and it covered up a hazard for drivers. It was over the curb and over all the construction and people were driving into it not knowing what they were, what they were going into. From the nearby courtyard by Marriott, Dusty Smith could see it all, including when his employee's car got stuck. Smith also tried to help a stranded stranger, but ended up needing help himself. I took him in my car and uh, hit a curb and destroyed my front left tire. While most of the water was quick to wash away, Smith and others now have ongoing car trouble. Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.